Hello and welcome to a special Editor's Pick edition of Aviation This Week. It's Friday, December 23rd, 2016. Today's edition is brought to you by Levero Aviation, your aviation solutions provider. I'm Tamara Teek and here are our Editor's Picks for 2016. Boeing celebrated its 100th anniversary this year. The Corsia emissions deal has the potential to improve aviation's carbon footprint worldwide. And Porter Airlines celebrated a special 10-year milestone in 2016. And now a message from our sponsor. Boeing celebrated 100 years of shaping the aviation industry in 2016. Correspondent David Carr wrote about the Boeing Company's close connections to Canada for most of the last century in the July-August issue of Wings magazine. Carr noted that there are more than 260 Boeing jetliners in service in Canada today. The company's biggest news of the year occurred in late November when the federal Liberal government chose to purchase 18 Boeing Super Hornets to augment the RCAF's aging fleet of CF-18s until a permanent replacement is decided. Global airlines united in October agreeing to significantly reduce overall carbon emissions in the aviation industry. The International Civil Aviation Organization's Montreal Summit resulted in the decision to implement a carbon offset and reduction scheme for international aviation referred to as Corsia. Correspondent Rick Adams' extensive coverage in the November-December issue of Wings magazine highlights the impact of this emissions deal. He writes that the 2.5 billion ton carbon reduction goal is roughly equivalent to taking 35 million cars off the road every year. Porter Airlines celebrated a significant milestone in 2016, its 10th anniversary. Editor Matt Nichols' November-December editorial in Wings magazine reflects on the company's journey. He writes that Porter grew from a handful of employees and two aircraft to 26 aircraft and more than 1,400 employees today. Correspondent David Carr also wrote in the March-April issue of Wings that Porter has grown to become the third largest scheduled airline in Canada and has yet to drop a single scheduled route. That's our show for now from Annex Business Media's Niche TV Newsroom. Thank you to our sponsor, Levero Aviation. We'll be back with more aviation news on January 6. On behalf of all of us here at Niche TV, thanks for watching.